Hello everyone, today we're going to create a Windows Vista bootable USB. So let's begin. Double click on when to flash. Click OK. We're going to click on this check mark, which is the wizard. And then what we're going to do is we're going to click on next. If you have a CD, click uh, leave this selected. If you don't have a CD, which I have an ISO, I'll be selecting this option, right? And click next. Now, mind you, if you do have a CD, it's going to ask you to pick the drive letter where the CD is located. Same, same here, where I'm going to pick the ISO where the lo location is going to be. So I'm going to pick uh, Windows Vista 32-bit and open. And the USB is already plugged in, right? Just click refresh. It's the only device there plugged in. And click next. Everything is looking good. Click next. What it's going to do is going to format your USB. And what you're going to do is you're going to click on continue. I set the license term and agreements. Click continue. And this will take a few minutes. Be right back. Okay, so now it's, a, it's all done. So what we're going to do is click on exit, right? Now, I want to make sure if my bootable USB actually works. So the cool thing is Winter Flash has an actual tool called bootable USB test. Let's double click on this. And what we're going to do is we're going to select the, your, your USB here, right? And I'm going to leave everything by default. And then we're going to click start. All right, so this is how you create a Windows Vista bootable USB. Like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching. Peace.